everybody, this is Janice Tatel, Chief Instructor at the Aikido Center of Dover. And I'm making a series of short videos with exercises and challenges you can do while you're at home, even in a small space. Today I'm going to work on footwork. Now, we all know how to walk, you've probably been doing it for at least a few years, but sometimes if you're stressed out, or if you're overthinking it, or if 10 guys are attacking you, we forget how to walk, we forget how to move properly. So it's important to practice your footwork until it's so natural that you can't mess it up. The most basic footwork is steps and slides. Stepping is just like walking, so you alternate your feet. Right, left, right, left, and backwards, same thing. But you should be in harmony every time. Forward, back. Slides, you move front foot forward. Bring it back to back. Make sure you watch where you're facing. Do not step and drag. Okay? It's more of a spring and snap. Okay? You bend your back knee, push forward, or your front knee, push back. That seems pretty simple, but everybody gets confused. Um, so it's important to practice, and you can play some games to get better at it. If you have a friend, even on Skype, you can challenge each other to steps and slides. So one person can say, step forward, step forward, step back, slide back, slide forward, step forward, step forward, slide forward, slide back, step back, step back, slide back, and see how fast you can go. You can also see how far you can slide. If you find a line, right here's a line, and see how far, you can go on one slide. Put a line on the floor and see if you can get better and better. You really need to spring off your back foot. Another thing you can do is you can take a pillow, put it on your head. Nice and steady. And then do the same thing. Steps. Or slides. Oops. Fall up, put it on again. And finally, you can try super slow walking. You can do slow races. So keep your knees bent. Go super slow. And again, you do forward. Slower, let's see. Move super, 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 super slow. Works on your balance. So that's steps and slides. You can also turn. If you are drawing a line, you can turn two ways. The easy way, through your belly button, or the back, or the hard way, where you twist up. You turn the easy way, turn it to the back, it's hang on. So you can just look and point. You turn the other way, so over your shoulder, it's an Amy hang on, where you lift your hands. I think this feels really nice, and you keep doing it until it feels nice and smooth, it's good practice. You can see you can do it and not put your back foot down, okay? So instead of landing in your back foot, you can see you can stop, just a toe, put it down. Or you can hold your foot up. Oops. You control it. Okay? That's one challenge. Another thing you can do is if you take a ball, balls go up and down with gravity, exactly the way you want to do it. Exactly the right speed. 9.8 meters per second squared. Don't worry about that. They always stop at the top. So you can take a ball and hold it lightly on the side. And follow the ball. Try to follow the ball with your hands and even let go of it so you're just following it. And then you know your hands are moving totally relaxed. So that's all for today. Next time, maybe we'll work on breathing. Um, everybody, so stay safe, stay healthy, wash your hands, keep training, and have fun. Thank you.